After you are unconscious, the doctor will make a vertical incision in your leg above your knee. Using retractors to pull back the skin, the surgeon will make a second incision in the muscle in order to expose the damaged knee joint. Next, your doctor will remove the patella or kneecap and flex your leg to expose the surface of the joint. Preparing the surface of the joint involves removing the damaged or diseased parts of the bone and then cutting and shaping the surface to allow the best fit possible for the artificial joint. Once your doctor is satisfied with this preparation, the team will drill holes in the tibia and femur. They will also prepare the inside surface of the kneecap and then coat the bony surface with a special cement. The metal pieces of the new joint are then installed on the tibia and femur. as well as the kneecap pad. Finally, your doctor places a spacer on the tibia surface. After a final check to make sure all components fit, and that the leg can move freely, the muscle and other tissues are closed with sutures. To aid in healing, your knee may be stabilized with a brace and you will be encouraged to use crutches during the recovery process.